Oh, every time. Oh no, oh no, oh no, there's a critter in here. Okay, we need to get our T-Rex front and center. Maximum guest exposure. Well, maintaining safety of course. Yeah, I mean, keep everyone safe, but don't overdo it. The protocols are guidelines, right? First and foremost, let's give our guests the show they've come to see. The ultimate T-Rex uh -oh. encounter. What in the, the world? roar of the crowd. The roar of our star performer. What in the Think world? Of the possibilities. They what happened to these guys? Comfort's low. Oh, the population's too high. Man! Ah, well, you guys wanted four of you guys. Sheesh. I have to get you guys to fix the heckin' wall over here. Man! Now we have a heckin' open up the open up the shelter. Open up the shelter. Open up the shelter. Open up the other shelter as well. God, we have those guys escaped. Man, open up the shelter. Open up the shelter. Come on! Click it! There we go. Gah! <laughs> oh, is the T-Rex out yet? Man, they're missing! How are they missing that much? Oh, T-Rex is escaping now. Oh. Are you kidding? There we go. God! Oh, uh-oh, uh uh-oh, uh-oh. Chasmosaurus is going to get him. Uh-oh, at task. Knock out the Chasmosaurus. I think that's probably why. I think their comfort level got really, really low. Because of the, uh... God, man, where's the other ACU? There we go. Oh, oh man, that's the move transport one. Uh, ACU. No, don't return to base. At task. Go. Get him. There's two there. Is that all of them? I'm um, not seeing any more of them on the loose, so I think I might be good. That's the only two of them that are highlighted right now, so that's good. Let's get the transport team to transport this one out. Of course, we have four of these hecking guys. Sheesh. Of course, I can just pick up this one. Maintain safety protocols. Yeah, I'm like this one. It's got the electric fence. Uh, electric, uh, concrete fence, gate thing, whatever. <laughs> so I think we're fine on this front. Let me just wait for them to tr uh, tra or a transport, not tranquilize. He's already been tranquilized. What am I saying? <laughs> Anyways, at task. Get that one. And that one. Try and get both of those guys nice and knocked out. Man, I'm like, they are big hacking targets. I'm not really uh, understanding how they're missing so much. <laughs> Come on. Oh, there you go. Got that one. At least they're, uh, I'm like, the try even, even strike. That's ferocious attack. But it's better than like a T-Rex out there, right? <laughs> Anyways, now we can pick up the T-Rex and just kind of transport it back inside of here, right? Yeah, like right there. There we go, alright. Now we can uh, close all shelters, or whatever, close shelter, and then close the other shelter, because everything's nice and safe now. Close shelter, alright! Well, that didn't really go according to plan, I, I really don't- oh. Contracts make the world go round. Or, was that money? Either way. <laughs> alright, well, I guess I could accept that. Release a uh, Taurus horse with a rating of 74. Anyways, I, yeah, I guess I can get rid of some of the Gallimimuses now that we... I'm like, I don't need, I literally do not need Gallimimuses at all, okay, sheesh. So, I guess I'll get ACU to take care of the Gallimimuses, because we have, literally, we have four of them. And we have Stigamolics, too, so, let's get rid of the Gallimimuses. There you go, I think we're fine now. I think someone's trying to escape, though. Someone's somewhere. Oh, yep, right here! Oh my god! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Pilot helicopter. Hold on. I need to dart this one. Come on! Man! Got him! Get that one too. Get him! Man! Come on! Man! No, at least they repaired it. Okay, that's good. Golly, these dumb things. I'm gonna sell them. There we go, another hit right there. Should be knocked out. And... There we go, fine a heckin' Lee. Didn't open up the heckin' things though, so... Ah, probably have a bunch of deaths and lawsuits and stuff. Man. En route to collect the asset. Ah, well, transport the Gallimimus. Sell. Heading to pick up the asset. Sell. Collecting asset. And sell, that would be four Heading of them. To collect the there we go. Acknowledging asset collection request. All Gallimimuses are gone now. T-Rex is trying to escape though. Why is he? Oh yeah, I know why he's trying to escape. <sighs> oh, he's agitated because he's in a heckin' small area. But we have about two minutes until the thing's over. And we could probably like sell him or move into the other area or something. Yeah. Uh, bro oh my god, they're escaping again. Oh my god. You have gotta be. That's it, I'm selling him. 
I said I'm selling these things. I'm selling these pieces of trash. Adding to the list. Oh my god. T-Rex escaping. Everything's going wrong. We're going to get ACU to take care of that T-Rex right now. But man, open all shelters. Forget it. Open all of them. <laughs> oh, repairing fence my butt. There we go. Come on. ACU. Take care of the Taurus or, or uh, whatever that thing is. Sheesh. Where are them up? Okay, there's only two of them, I think. I think we're fine. Okay, oh my god, that gate, that, that fence went down. Oh, sheesh. T-Rex is trying to escape out of this side now. God, at least he forgot about that side being completely open. Probably because that's the border of the map. <sighs> so we can't go into there. Golly. I'm selling all these, these Tekken Triceratops wannabes with their fake little armored plates. <laughs> oh, he's been, he's been tranked. He's been tranked. And the countdown just got paused. Okay. So, let me get the... Well, Rangers aren't coming over here to repair that, so... Whatever. Let me just pick them up and place them right back down. I can sell these things. I don't know, I guess they might be fine now, though. They might be fine now. Because, of course, I got rid of the Gallimimuses, so they shouldn't try to escape, right? That one's still out and about, though. What in the world? Oh, they're still trying to get them. Let me try and get them. Because I'm MLG at it, no brag! Come on! Oh, what in the... Oh, jeez. Pilot helicopter, no. Get the rifle! And let's shoot him. Trying to compensate for the distance. And got a hit right there, nice. And he's tracked. Got a nice. Alright, let's transport it back. Hopefully they're fine. Destination. There we go. So how the heck can do it now? Are they okay? Sheesh. Oh my god. R Rangers. Oh my. Turn the heck around. There's a hole in the wall over there. Oh jeez. This is going to bite me in the butt right now, you guys. I'm building these buildings too close. I can't get back there. Come on. Come on, come on. Get to the gate before anything escapes. Get to it. Yes. Repair obstructed by what? There you go. Got it. Golly. <laughs> Oh, at least everyone's already inside of the shelters, right? Lawyers, right? <laughs> Let me get the uh, rangers. Is someone, they're escaping again. Oh, it's probably the T-Rex. Yeah, it's the T-Rex trying to escape. 13 seconds then. Oh, jeez, that's going down. That's going down, that's going down, that's going down. ACU. ACU, ACU, ACU. Knock him out, knock him out. Knock him out, ACU, both ACUs, come over here. God, man, I'm trying to go between each and every one of them. ACU, come here. Oh, we got it finally! Jeez! Too much trouble, but we got it. <laughs> $2.5 million, and the Kentrosaurus is now available. Noish. All right. Yeah, that's how we do it in the entertainment division. Sure, the scientists can bring them back from the break, but we put them in front of the world. Heck of a job. Heck of a job. I understand the appeal of featuring the T-Rex. I mean, I get it. Really. But if that show of yours ever goes pear-shaped, well, you know what can happen. Any doubt? Ask your friend, Dr. Malcolm. Oh. Uh, drive vehicle, has that been re Yes, that's been repaired. Okay, that's good. Oof. I think everything's fine now, hopefully. How are these guys doing? Comfort's still low. I don't know why. Oh, it's going up, though. Okay, that's good. Whew. That's good. Yeah, the overpopulation's definitely what got them, though. What in the world? Uh... Oh, that one's still... Okay. <laughs> I need to pick that one up. I guess that one got knocked down. I just forgot about it. Anyways, let me move this T-Rex to the T-Rex area. And then, of course, we'll get rid of this T-Rex. Because this one's kind of old. Might as well sell it or something, right? So, add task. Knock him out. There we go. Let me actually pilot it. Because I like actually shooting him like this. This is actually kind of cool. So, he's not really doing anything. He's not running away or anything. So, it should be kind of easy to get him from here. Standing still, too. Just got to compensate for the... What in the world? Yeah, it's like completely random. Oh, wait, he got hit right there, though. That's good. Ooh, come on. He's moving target, moving target. Because we're always the hardest to hit. Because you have to anticipate where they're going to be and where they're going to go. And that's a great hit right there. Nice. Let's get another one just for the road. Just in case that's not enough. Just in case he needs three hits. All shelters open. What in the world? Oh, yeah. I, I should probably open them up. Or close them or whatever here in a sec. Is three or two not enough? I might have to actually do three. Hopefully I can get them knocked out before the uh, 
the other one lands in here, or else I guess we'll have T-Rex versus the T-Rex, but they're exactly the same, so... We can only imagine that the T-Rex is going to win, right? Come on! He's standing still, what? Yeah, it's just like shooting off randomly, not in the middle where I'm shooting, so... My horrible accuracy isn't completely to blame, right? <laughs> oh, got another hit right there, too, nice. And he's out, perfect, perfect. Let's get the transport to sell this one. He's old, so might as well get rid of him and replace him with a new one that we made for the entertainment division. So there we go. All right, so the other one's kind of agitated. Hopefully his comfort's going to go right back up when he goes in this fantastic, specially made area for the T-Rex. Hopefully he's going to be fine. Oh, man. Is that one going to get transported out before that one comes over? Oh. Uh-oh, this is going to be a close one, you guys. Oh, he sees it. He, he knows. His comfort's really low, though. His comfort should be going up, though. Social is really high, but it should it should stabilize here in just a moment. When that one's officially considered out of the park, out of the out of the area. Comfort's going up, I think. No, it's going down. I, I think it was 48, now it's 47. Should be going. Oh, he's drinking while, while he's roaring. I don't know how that, and there we go. Okay, comfort's going up now. That's great. 48, 49, 50, 51. Perfect. All right, he's just drinking right now. Grasslands right on the edge. Force is right on the edge. Hopefully his comfort's going to go into the blue or for uh, he's done drinking because I don't want him to try and escape because of course we've seen that already before where critters com completely in a perfect area but because their comfort's already set like really really low then they're trying to escape I think that's like the metric and the or something like that right let's check up on the Indominus it's been a little while how's he doing he's doing fantastic right how many how many goats has he killed Dazzle's killed zero goats killed 22 <laughs> oh wow yeah look at that that's actually kind of cool current sale value $770,000 so if I tried to sell him I'd only get like a tenth of my money back. <laughs> that is nothing. Let's check a star rating. Modifications 208, authenticity plus 91. Not like that's really an option. That, yeah, like, if you want to get an anonymous, you have to have 100% authenticity, anyways. Before 481 rating, that's really good, actually. I think that's lower than the T Rex, right? I'd strongly suggest you consider taking this contract. I don't think that's possible on this map. 10 new dinos? I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh, oh, oh he is trying to. Oh, jeez. He is trying to escape his comfort. How's his comfort doing? It's good. It, it, it's fine now. It's fine now. Let me get some rangers over here. Let me get ACU just to preemptively try and target him before anything happens. No! No! Man, I knew that happened. Oh my gosh. Open the shelters. Oh, at least I got ACU over there. Hopefully knocking him out. Hopefully. Oh, that helicopter. Let me get him. Let me get him, let me get him. I'm MLG as heck, no brag. Nice hit right there, no brag. Another hit right there, I think, no brag. We're both in. Got him! Nice! Alright. Let's close the shelters now. Man, that was crazy close. His, his comfort was right on the line when he broke that. God. That's what I'm saying, is that they could be in a perfect area for him, but because their comfort's still, you know, reduced from previous agitation and whatnot, they'll still try and break out like that. So that's very, very unfortunate that had to happen right there. I even caught it right there, but the rangers, they were like right there, but they didn't repair it. <laughs> Literally, the ranger stage is just feet away, and they didn't even get there in time to repair it. Probably because it was obstructed by a dinosaur. I wonder why. <laughs> oh, man. Anyways, release Taurus Wars with a rating of 74 should be able to do that, especially if we get rid of those whatever the fake news trikes are over here. <laughs> uh, yeah, these guys are actually doing pretty well, so that's good. They they want a very, very specific amount of uh, people for their... Pff, people. Of uh, Tasmasaurus for their uh, social rating. They're right on the line for population, though, so... Very, very close to having more heckin' escapes over here, but... How's the uh, Stigmolic doing? Yeah, right on the line for social for them, but... In terms of population for the other guys, I, I really don't want to have a, another one. I don't, I don't really want to have another friend for these guys, but uh, they're actually pretty decently high rated, so can't complain one bit. All right, I think things are going great for the park right now, you guys. Very, very noise. Let's check up on everything over here, make sure we can make good money from everything, even though we have very, very reduced amounts of people compared to, you know, other parks, especially because of the size of this map, right? Are people actually going to the restaurant now? Zero people. What is going on? Like, uh, there's literally zero people here. That is just an anomaly. Gift shop. 71. I'm like, it, I'd, it makes sense if there was like maybe 10 people there or something like that. But literally zero for how long? Golly. <laughs>
Anyways, what all do we have to do next? Uh, oh yeah, science and... Nice, we have everything for entertainment, so no need to worry about them anymore. Very close to getting that on security. Still have a lot for science ahead of us. And then, of course, we're going to get the Carno once we get a very high science rating. So that's good. Or a reputation or whatever you want to call it. So might as well get another science contract. This new contract just came in, and it has your name written all over it. That sounds good to me. Maintain a total guest count of at least 2,200 for four continuous minutes. That's fine. I think we're... They always set these to like very close to what your current number is, so it probably isn't. Especially because we just had a, uh, we're at uh, 2099 right now. We only need to get 101 people, and then of course sustain that for four whole minutes. But we just had closed shelters or open shelters, I guess you could say, for a little while. So we probably lost a lot of people there. So once things stabilize after all that shenanigans, I think we should be over that 2200 number and get that mission done quite easily, I'd say. But for the time being, releases Taurus Wars with a rating of 74. We do have very, very minimal room for uh, population for the Chasmosaurus or whatever it was. But I'll, I'll make one anyways. So 74 rating for the Taurus Wars. How are these guys doing? Oh yeah, I can do it like right now, no problem. So let's do that. So let's get that Taurus Wars going and get the entertainment. I'm like, we don't need to get the entertainment division mission. I could cancel it, but no real need to do that. I'm like, eh, we already have entertainment completely maxed out on all their missions and stuff. Like, we're, we're, oh wow, everything's five stars in this one, that's great. I guess that's one of the good things, is that, because it's a smaller island, it's, it's, it's a little bit easier to go five stars on it, you know? So that's good. Oh, man, it was tough, though. I'm like, with the, how, I have to, like, build around everything and try and make each enclosure just the right size and make sure you're making just the right amount of money to, you know, sustain what you're trying to do. I'm like, I'm actually, it was, it was kind of a miracle that we're actually able to do this. Kind of unfortunate we, we don't have a stop like directly over here with the uh, research center and all that kind of stuff, but I'm like, the, there is a monorail stop kind of close by, so can't really complain too much about that. There's three stops on a tiny little island like this. One at the very beginning, one in the middle, one at the very end. I think that gets the job done just fine. Don't need to worry about that at all. Anyways, check about the Taurus horse. Eh, he's about 27% done. Not that bad. Not that bad. I feel like I might just pause the recording. Wait for the Taurus horse to incubate. I guess I can open up the gate now. Uh, open gate, and uh, I'll check up on everything around here, see if I'll actually be able to get, oh man, I'm getting really low frame rate over here too, sheesh, see if I'll be able to get more money, and therefore be able to get the income per minute from attractions up significantly, maybe I'll get the dino shirt, I'll sell that for heckin' $20, might as well, might as well sell everything for double the expense, that's current gen, might as well keep that as is, Jurassic Nom, let's, let's do the Giganto steak for $40 over here, I guess this might be a better location. I don't know. <laughs> Let's see, though. Sell that for that. Much money. Fast food. How are we doing here? $28 dino fees. Really, really good amount of people there, you guys. Sheesh. Sell over 30. Just get a little bit extra cash. And we're up to $54,000 already now. Nice. Dino onesie. Sell that for 40 Just because, why not? People buy it, right? <laughs> Just like anything else. Still no one there. Bowling Alley's doing really, really well. Holy heck. 30 pin, let's do that for 35. Manage staff, get a little, oh, I guess the higher price already dropped the amount of people there, sheesh. Uh, toy shop, how are we doing here? Dino Pledge, let's do the RCSaurus. Sell that for heckin' $24, that sounds good. Uh, I guess we could do 21 if we wanna do 1.5 times the amount, but we need the heckin' money! And the bar already has two times the amount. I know there's a $52 heckin' cocktail there. <laughs> Sheesh, people buy it though. Security division over here giving us $10,000 a minute, so that's definitely supplementing us quite well. Gift shop over here with the night vision goggles for $40. I guess I can lower that a little bit, but of course it's going to eat into our money. Or I'll raise it to 50. Well, I raise it to 50, and there's 100 people in there now. Nice. <laughs> All right. Well, I don't really have any other way of making more money. Ah, oh, man, fast food went down though from that. Gah. Oh, no, it's back up. I think. I don't know. I might be going crazy. <laughs> Not too hard to believe, right? But, uh, I don't... Toy, do we have a toy? I don't know if we have a toy shop. We have a gift shop. Bowling alley, blah, blah, blah. Oh, yeah, we have a toy shop. Is there something here we don't have? Toy shop, the bar. Yeah, we have a bar, clothes shop. We have that. Restaurant, we have that. We have everything here. We have a gift shop. That's this right here, yeah. I guess we can get another hotel, but... Ah, uh, that doesn't really matter. I guess I, guess I could build... Like we have an arcade there, we have we have food, we have shopping, we have drink, we have fun over here. Mm, I guess I'll try and figure it out. 
maybe a little bit later. Keep guest count of a, above 2,200. That should keep going up, right? It's still at 2,099. That might go up if I can squeeze in another hotel. That's what ready to be released. Nice. But I, I literally cannot squeeze that in anywhere, you guys. Ah. Uh, maybe here? Mm, nah, I don't think I could squeeze it anywhere, you guys. Gah. Man. I look back here, I was barely able to squeeze it in there. Right here, I, I guess I can maybe move the restaurant and stuff. <sighs> I don't know. Oh, disease contracted. I don't know. I I, I guess. Oh, up to $57,000 a minute now. That's good. Disease contracted there. Let's get the rangers to take care of that. Proceeding to the feeder now. Well, I guess they're resupplying the feeder. <laughs> Let's get another ranger. Task received. There we go. Resupply Setting those feeders. And go heal the fella up. Make sure he doesn't die. Speaking of resupplying feeders, let's get those resupplied. Taurus Wars to get that released, and that should get the uh, entertainment division thing nice and done. And we're just kind of coasting along right now, you guys. We're doing a pretty good job. Not bad, not bad. Let's get another ranger over here. Take care of the. Acknowledging request for feeder resupply. Let's take care of the feeders that don't really need to be res resupplied, as well as have another one take care of the feeders that do need to be. Oh man, it spread! It spread! We need another ranger team. To which one? Which one is it? That's. Medicating? Yes. Let's get this one. Uh, he's resupply. Now, nah, forget about that. You're going to be medicating the other one. Medicate both. There you go. And then medicate that. Or, <laughs> oh, medicate the feeders, yes. <laughs> Anyways, they should get them, right? I'm like, you're right in front of them. So, oh, three of them have been hit now. Pfft, dry vehicle. Let me get them. Eyes on the prize. Overshot that. Uh, there we go. Hit. Nice. Is that? There we go. That one's good. Where's the, uh... Oh, in the background. Alright, let's go get him. Let's go get him. And don't crash into one, though. But boom Got him! Nice, nice! And medication has been administered. Perfect. No disease dinosaurs detected. Great. And they're going to go resupply the feeders. That's good. Alright. Taurus Wars has been released, and income per minute hit 60,000. Perfect! Anybody who thinks creating entertainment with dangerous creatures hundreds of millions of years old is easy is crazy. Yet, you're making it look easy, and that's crazy. Yeah, and I'm not bragging either. Yeah! <laughs> Prestige matters. And that's a wrap! Yep, another one down. And another one down for Science Division. Keep up this kind of work, and you'll be going places. Yep. I'm like, uh, oh man, we're right on the line. We need to get another mission for loyalty bonus for entertainment division, you guys. Wow. Uh, no loyalty bonus from uh, security, though. Probably feeling a little bit jealous of all my attention I'm giving to Ener or Isaac over here. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, we're right on the line for security. Oh, oh, feeder. Oh. Uh, right on the line for science, not security. So. Which, which feeder needs to be... One of them. I don't know. Maybe it just got resupplied right there. I don't know. <laughs> Either way. What do we need to do? Oh, yeah. How, how's our guest count right now? Is it... Oh, 2141. Okay, that's good. That's good. It's going up. I mean, I, I'll, I'll, I'll just give it a little bit of time. And it'll go up to that 2200. And then, of course, we need to keep it there for a whole, uh, like, four minutes or something like that, right? So, let's get another science division mission. An offer just came our way. Don't let it sit too long. I guess I'm going to have to use an inferior upgrade at our ranger station just to get this one done, but I'll do it anyways. It's not only the dinosaurs that are alive here. The facility itself is a kind of organism. It needs to grow. Nurture it. There we go, got it. And I'll go back to 2.0 now. <laughs> Are we at 3.0? See, this is what we need more of around here. You see an opportunity and you seize it. Cheers. Yeah, I might as well keep the uh, upgrade, the accuracy, and the reload speed on that, just because why not, right? And I think I might have done the same thing for ACU. Let me make sure that I can upgrade those to accuracy. Yes, I can. Accuracy 3.0. That's really good. Really wish I remembered this earlier on. <laughs> Maybe they would have knocked out critters a little bit easier, a little bit faster, right? Accuracy 2.0. Let's go to 3.0 on everything, and I think we're good to go there. All right. Got to go do the same thing over here at this other ranger station and other ACU center, of course, just because... Remember, we did a, uh, oh, there you go, and reload speed, 3.0, because we did do all the researches for everything on this map, which also included accuracy 2.0, or 3.0 on everything, and reload speed 3.0 on everything, so that's great. 
And let's get reload speed three. There we go. And reload speed three. Perfect. All right. So, oh, wait, yeah. Does it say how, how much better that is? Uh, improved rifle maintenance vastly increases. It doesn't say like a specific number. So, yeah, it just says it greatly increases and vastly increases. Okay. Two completely different words that mean the same thing. Show business is all about the deal. And I am all about this next contract. You should be too. I don't even have that thing unlocked. I need to wait until security division gives me that, so I can't do that, Isaac. I'm sorry. Let's get another, uh, has it been two minutes yet? I might be able to get another mission. Ah, less than a minute left, but whatever. How are we doing on, uh, guest count now? 2141. That still hasn't updated, I guess. Wow, look at that. 19 dinosaurs. I wonder, maybe we have to hit 20 dinosaurs in order for that to turn green. Or maybe it's always going to be blue. But great variety, great welfare, great safety, great capacity, great satisfaction. This is honestly our greatest <laughs> map yet, you guys. We're doing really well here. And I'm not bragging, okay? I'm, I'm just I'm just stating facts here, okay? Eh, like, come on. <laughs> 2140, yeah. That really needs to change. Come on. Food rating's like really low, but still, we have five-star facility, no brag. But anyways, let's get another, uh, should be able to get another science. I might just do security. Let's do security, and we'll get science done. Now this contract is perfect for improving the security division. I'd be disappointed if you reject it. Well, I can't get the Carnotaurus genome just yet, because I think I need, I think I need to be maxed out, or, you know, the highest uh, reputation for science for that, right? But I might as well, ah, I guess I'll accept it. I guess I'll accept it. But let me check that again real quick. Hold on, uh, reputation, there we go. Uh, yeah, next to unlock is Carnotaurus. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, we get Carnotaurus next, right? Yes, Intensive Repair 2.0 just got unlocked. Uh, a little while ago, at least. <laughs> I don't know if we need to actually research that. I guess we can go check. Go to the research center. Yep, we actually have to research it. So, Intensive Repair 3.0. There we go, get that nice and researched. Kind of spend some money. Is there anything else that I might need to research? No, everything else. <laughs> everything else is at zero items available, which is the way I like it, right? Anyways, might as well get another expedition out to continue getting the sauropod known as the Camarasaurus. So let's get that one. And there we go. And anything else that I may need, like the Pachycephalosaurus. Is there a location better for it? Oh yeah, Ch Chasmosaurus. That also needs 100%. Oh yeah, that's probably why those Chasmosauruses were so agitated. Is that, the, you know, they don't have a full genome, you know? They're at like 80 six or something like that, right? So, they're probably a little bit more prone to be agitated and whatnot. While the 100% genome ones, I think those are a little bit more calm or something like that, right? I, I don't know. I might just be assuming things over here, right? But anyways, how's the guest count doing now? 2140, that literally has not changed yet. <laughs> I don't know how it hasn't changed, but I guess maybe I can get some more dinos, some new critters in here. Uh, how about... Hmm... Where's the, oh, there it is right there, Metro, okay, oh yeah, I was about to say, maybe I can get a second one of these, but I can't, yeah. It, it, it's pretty much maxed out whenever there's just one of them, though. But, what about over here? What about the, uh, yeah, we have the Ceratosaurus, yeah, show me what, yeah, I can get a second one of those, no problem. Indominus Rex, I think that's one that, yeah, another lone star over there. And same thing with the T-Rex, of course, because that was in the red when there was a second one in there, yeah. So, I guess if anything, we could get another Ceratosaurus, just to kind of help supplement our rating, hopefully. And hopefully bring in more people, even though our rating for everything is maxed out, and I'm not even bragging. <laughs> let's go max, or uh, let's go incubate another one. What is this current skin? It is coastal pattern. Wetland pattern. Ooh, that's new to me. So let's get the wetland one. That seems cool. Incubate for $1.4 million, you guys. Wow. All right, well, he's going to be a guaranteed incubation, so don't need to worry about him. He's at 41% right now, plus 60% from that, so that's good. Expedition have been completed. Perfect. Wow, look at all those sauropod fossils, you guys. Sheesh. Extract DNA. Extract two three stars right there. Pycephalosaurus is going to get extracted two star. It might get mad. I don't think it's going to... Yeah, yeah, we have to extract that one, so that's, that's going to... I think it will. With two two stars... That should hit 100% because it's at 92 right now. It should hit 100%, but it might not. You don't know. Cast one extract DNA on that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. And I don't have any more room in the queue, unfortunately, so... Man, look at all those Chasmosaur or uh, Camarasaurus fossils we have here, you guys. Sheesh. <laughs> Anyways, let's go on. Speaking of like, expeditions and whatnot, let's go on another expedition here in a second. Stratosaurus is about 25% done. Not bad at all. Let's continue getting... Oh, wow! Oh no, Camarasaurus is completely depleted there. Does that mean I can't get him anymore? I think it does. 
Um, I'm like, I have a decent amount of fossils right now. Because uh, this site's depleted over here, Chimerosaurus, Devilonicus. This one's depleted over here as well. Ooh. Oh, oh, here we go. Come here. There's another location right there. Okay, that's good. Diplodocus, Pachycephalosaurus, Pachycephalosaurus, or Parasaurus. What else do we have? Pachycephalosaurus there. Caspasaurus. Yeah, there we go. All right. Now we have expedition team taking care of all that, so that's good. And let's queue up all the extra fossils over here if we can. Because this guy has 70-something DNA. We have so many fossils for him, and all of the sites are depleted except for one. So I don't think they would put it in the game where it's possible for you to deplete all the sites and not get a full genome. I don't, I don't, that might be possible, but I don't think they'd do it like that. that that'd kind of be a kick in the you-know-what if they did that, okay? <laughs> that wouldn't be very cool. But 74% genome with, like, six more fossils? Even though they're all one star except for one that's two star? It's probably going to get close, like eight. 80 something, maybe 90 something percent. I wouldn't be surprised. Still 2,141 people in the park though. Golly, come on. <laughs> uh, let me see if I can build another thing over here. What do we have? We have a restaurant, clothes shop, and an arcade. I guess we can get a toy shop over here just for the kids and stuff, you know? There we go. And see if I'll be able to squeeze one in anywhere. I might be able to put one like right here where this path is. Maybe. I don't think I'd be able to put one here, though, unless, of course, I manipulated the landscape a little bit. Because that is extremely tilted down there, so I need to flatten this out hardcore. Uh, I think I was able to put a toy shop right there just for a split second, you guys. Hold on. Might be able to squeeze one in right here and have a terrible-looking path. <laughs> but might be able to get one there. Man, I don't think I could place one there. I don't know if... I, I don't think I could get rid of that road right there and that'd make room. Man, really wish I could. Man, this roadway is just hecked up. Excuse my language. <laughs> oh, jeez. This looks like absolutely not a trash. Try and fix it, though. Maybe cover up that nasty looking area with trees. <laughs> God, man, that looks terrible. <laughs> that looks honestly like horrifyingly bad, you guys, but at least I can smooth it out a bit, right? Try and smooth it out. That way it's, you know, level-ish. There we go. I think that's... I think that's fixing it a bit. There we go. But yeah, I don't think I'll be able to squeeze in any shops anywhere, unfortunately. So, ah, what are you going to do? Uh, I might be able to put, like, a toy shop just randomly, like, right... Oh, oh! Uh-uh, was that it? Oh, I think that was... Oh, toy shop time! There we go! Holy heck! Just a random toy shop out in the middle of nowhere! Yes! <laughs> ah, I love it! All right, let's build a substation here. There we go. Connect that up, and we're good to go, you guys. All right. <laughs> now we have a random toy shop there. Perfect. I think we have two toy shops now. Uh, one bowling alley, one arcade, two... Oh! Some things come up that could be interesting. And profitable. Nice, that's another guaranteed one, no problem. No brag either. No guest by carnivores. What about... <laughs> no guest deaths by carnivores. What about guest death by herbivores? Thank you.